Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Baldur's Gate 2. The reason I'm loading up is because Minsk has something to say to us literally the second we un it unpaused. So we follow the path that surely leads to glory. Boo is proud to be here. I can tell. It is not worthy of such a fuss, Minsk. A simple, uninspiring act of charity. And he should be. We are righteous. We are the righteous stand standard by which others are judged. I'm not trying to please your rodent. I do this because it will benefit me in the long term. Minsk, have you considered getting restorative magic for that head of yours? Ah, it is not worthy of such a fuss, Minsk. A simple, uninspiring act of charity. Then say it louder. We must inspire fear and evil. Quiet tales of hamsters are foolish, but a man and his hamster that tear evil limb from limb? That's scary. I only help because it's profitable to do so. I'm not some traveling charity show. Uh, yes, so I don't think you will be scaring quite who you expect. How do I get out of this dog and pony show? Ah, what the hell. Right, oh, Minsk. Our deeds will ring in the evil ears we box and label uh, Do Not Open Till Midwinter Fest. Now you are speaking the language of Minsk. Next we must get you a hamster, or perhaps an ice weasel, whatever whatever your tastes. Eh, I wouldn't mind having a sleek. Sleeks are fun. We'll be done. And then, whereas you are saying go for the eyes, Boo, I could be saying go for the neck! But would I name it Kodo or Podo? Hmm. So yeah, literally the second I unpaused, that happened. Uh, so, uh, also, what is my reputation? Where is that? Popular, 16. Yep. We're uh, getting a little high. Without doubt. It's going to be hard to get some people into the party. But we'll figure something out at that point. Come on, guys. Hurry up. Why are you so slow? You gather your party before venturing. and precisely. Alright, so first of all, the things that I want to leave here... Iron Rod, I don't need that right now. Mechrath's Mirror, I don't need. I guess some books I don't need. I can leave them here until I uh, collect more. All yeah, we'll leave the books. Keep hold of the Yonkeg shell. Keep hold of the uh, wave shaft. Don't need the planter prison key. That should be fine for now. Without hesitation. All right, the books can go in here, I think. It's not a bookshelf, but I think I was putting some other things on the bookshelf. Yeah. Oh, right, this is all my arrows. That can be these can be sold. Story-related things can go here, I think. Go ahead and take those back. I'll deposit these somewhere else. These, however, will be sold. I do not need that many plus-one weapons. Do you have any acid arrows? No. Uh, 
Okay, you do have the arrows of biting, so that's good. I can stack those. I guess I'll give you this anyway. All right, Keldorn. Aye, as you wish. Deposit some of this stuff here. Uh, you do not need this many spare bolts. And we'll go ahead and leave these here as well, for now. Minsk. Where Minsk goes, evil stands aside. Go ahead and leave some arrows. You can keep that many. That's fine. All right. So, Mail of the Dead. I don't know if I'll sell it. Longsword plus two, I can probably sell. Battle axe plus two, I can probably sell. Varscona. Your longsword does the extra cold damage. Might be worth... Actually, you know, I should probably give... Like, I don't really need you to be using your katana, other than the fact that it does 1d10 damage. Do you have... Yeah, you have longsword proficiency, so there is that. That is a short sword, though. And one extra attack per round is actually pretty good. Hmm. One extra attack per round. Not sure how that's going to work out. Actually, you know what? If we do this... That would make you uh, a bit more powerful. Although, your Thaco is uh, probably going to suck. 17 to 20. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's not, not great... Yeah, no, let's uh let's not do that then. Right, you got all of your all of your magical bolts there. Far too many uh, magical arrows there. I don't really have anyone who uses short swords, so... Alright, uh, that's a throwing axe. Okay. This will not take long. Let's have everyone come down. So actually, before if we do must that... Be done. It will be done. Anything you have... Uh, uh, I know a discerning eye when I see one. You have anything interesting... Arrows plus two. Arrows of piercing. Acid arrows. That's good to keep in mind, actually. Uh, protector plus one might be good, but that's awfully expensive. Uh, some potions. Mostly just plus one weapons here. Yeah, and that's all stuff that I've sold. Not worth it. Okay. Uh, basically, at this point, the only things that he has are uh, missiles. Certainly. That would be interesting. All right. I'm listening. Let's get going. We still have strength on, uh, higher strength on Keldorn and Minsk, but it's not that big of a deal. Keldorn should be getting the strength spell as well, actually. Might actually want to cast that. And again, I have to do that inside a building or something, which is a little frustrating. 
Okay, uh, I don't think we've been into the estate. Haven't been into some of these buildings down here. Haven't been into the Temple of Helm and haven't been into the derelict house. So let's uh, come down here. There was a lower floor that I think I checked out and then was like, yeah, let's not do that yet. <laughs> that seems like it might be of questionable um, how to put it how to put it uh, politely it seemed like it might have been uh, a little bit more than I wanted to do at that time basically when I wanted to go uh, visit this that place howdy uh, courtesan and there's also this building here Alright, in we go. So I have looked at those. Certainly. Let's head down here. Yeah. Without doubt. This looks very familiar. Like I have been in a place very similar to this already. And precisely. You feel very uneasy as you approach the sarcophagus. The lid looks heavy, but you could remove it if you wish to. Sure, what's the worst that could happen? You uh, push aside the heavy. You push the heavy lid aside, and the foul stench of rot nearly overcomes. Strangely, nothing lies within but the gilded torso of a skeleton. Power surges, and a creature appears. Where? Elemental Lich. You are foolish to follow the whims of Kangax. He will not be grateful for your service. What are you talking about? Regardless, your quest ends here. I have not sacrificed all to have, an, have idiot adventurers awaken our doom. Die, fools! Okie dokie. I am uh, ready. I can dance on the head Yoshimo, of a you get down well. My weapon does nothing! Yaw. Yeah, Yaw. Yeah. Improved mantle. Ooh, is anyone able to hit? I am not. Not even a scratch. Hmm. Try a remove magic. Can't actually see the uh, elemental lich. Circle there. Okay, so remove magic, dispel effects, breach. Doesn't look like those things got breached. So, and then he casts time stop. All right, yeah, we cannot handle the now, these things now. right now. Come on, kill something now! Yeah, it will be done. I tried, but you couldn't hurt it, you dink. All right. We'll have to come back here later. Get get up the stairs, please. Thank you. Certainly. Why is there this abandoned house with trap doors and just a lich down below? What do you want, friend? Can you not see that I am busy here? Oh, terribly sorry. I'll wait in the graveyard then. I think you visit there occasionally. Oh, hey, this is a guy that I'm looking for. Didn't even think about that. I think you'll listen to me, and you'll do it now. Or do I have to involve the guards? Far be it from me to interrupt the spending of your blood money. Yes, very busy. And so are your clothes. Very vividly red, in fact. What? All right, then. What is it you want? What are you trying to pull here? All 
I bring greetings from uh, Tear Deer. Uh, you are his man in red? Uh, yes, the color matches. Tear Deer, but he's... It was that little weasel Sethley, wasn't it? He told you. I knew I shouldn't trust him, but I had no choice, though. Them or me. So you've been kidnapping people and dumping them. That's monstrous. It pays the bills. If you want in, I'll cut you a slice. I'm sure we can work something out. No, I don't think that's an option. Your plot is uncovered. Only a fool would join. And only a fool would cross my partners. Damn, they're going to kill me. You don't know what you've done to me. Open the doors, boys. I gotta get in. Found the man in red responsible uh, for Tadir, but he seems to fear his partners more than any punishment at my hands. He fled into a house, and no doubt that is where his fellow... I don't know. Conspirators are. Alright, well, let's... Go inside. I'm sorry, I don't know how she found out. That ain't why we're mad, you little rock gnawing fool. You were supposed to kill them sacks, not dump them. I, I, I couldn't. I can't. I can't stand the blood. So drown them. Whack them with a stick. I don't care. What kind of... We have to go, Kematis. We've got company. Not before I kill this riddle, little rat stick. Not before. Wait, what? Why can I not stop this? Look at how much time it's taking him to do it. I'll take his money. I can dance on the head of a pin as well. One gold there. Well, aquamarine and an Agni money necklace. No idea who those people were. Exactly and precisely. No idea if I'll have Stand an... Stand where you're at, peasant. Who is there? What do you vermin wish now? The guard will hear of this outrage. Who? You are not my captors. Who are you? I demand to be freed. Uh, of course. I will release your bonds at once. Well, I thank you, then. I have been in this place too long. No doubt my ransom was on the way, but I begin to doubt they would have released me. Uh, They've killed others, buried them alive. A cruel, if bloodless, death. Then you have saved me from a grim fate indeed. I have nothing of value on me to repay your kindness, I'm afraid. I offer my sincere thanks, however. I mean, if you're a lady, I'll take some, uh, you know, like, high-status praise. You know, speak up my name to uh, the other nobles, that kind of thing. I and my descendants are in your debt. Farewell. Well, I got some experience. I'm ready. Fleet of foot and all that. All right, Yoshimo, check out uh, these things. A ransom note. A single short sword. Yeah, hundred nine gold. I'll take that. We will honor your demands in exchange for the release of Lady Elgia. As per your request, I will meet you in front of the Copper Coronet after nightfall, and I will bring the ransom. Welther. Note copied. So now I have to wait until nightfall. Boo. Well, we can explore a little bit more of a town, I suppose. Of Without this hesitation. Section. Oh, hello. This Missed will not you. take long. Ow. Oh. Alright, well. There you go. Just <laughs> put that stuff there. <laughs> Never want to see it again. Ah, uh, well. yes, the city. With all its people done. and their accumulated oh, wealth. Yes. You guys are still here. C can I not talk to you? Oh. Hello? Well, 
You've gone hostile. What about the other guy? What the heck is that sound? Well, he's dead. Yes. The other guy just like ran off. <laughs> Left him to his fate. Be done. Hello. Oh, hey. She. <laughs> Fear is close of no confidence. Oh my! With vengeance. Now he's dead. <laughs> I have no idea why it worked that way, but whatever. Uh, senses of the cat. Plus five versus missile attacks. Boots of Avoidance. The magic of these boots was specifically designed to detect incoming missiles and aid the wearer in avoiding them. They were originally commissioned by the instructor of an archery academy who was tired of suffering accidents at the hands of his inexperienced students. Yes. Yes, and the, archer, uh, the, the leader of an archery academy just happened to have the money to afford commissioning a magic item. Totally makes sense. Also, I just realized something. Why have I not given this to Aerie? <laughs> oh god, the container's full! No! No! Why? What is preventing this? Oh, the cloak the cloak of protection? What? That's ridiculous. Cloaks and rings are supposed to work together. Mm. Uh, let's see. Might work with you then. No, oh. well, I'll work with you then. That works. Okay. I mean... Uh, okay, yeah, no, I guess it's armor class zero. Alright, makes sense. Yeah, it is plus one. Alright. Well, that was uh, an interesting little encounter. Uh, I guess we'll meet some people outside the Copper Coronet still, though. There's Certainly. No reason not to. Has that actually completed that quest? Yep, that's finished. Alright. Uh, we're never going to be able to finish this one. Yeah, we have no other actual, like, pressing quests at the moment, so that's interesting. Ah, uh, we are all heroes. You and Boo and I, hamsters and rangers everywhere, rejoice! This is Cragmoon. Hello there. What can I get for you, dearie? Something to ease your aches? A potion or two for the dangers of the road? You have potions? I'll take a look. Uh, potions of healing, elixirs of health, antidotes, potions of regeneration, cold resistance, defense, 
Invisibility, Hill Giant Strength, Fire Resistance, Heroism, Stone Form, Power, and Vulnerability, Speed, Master Thievery, Agility, Genius, Fortitude, Frost Giant Strength, and Stone Giant Strength. And you will not buy my uh, Chainmail Armor, huh? Alright, well, that's, uh, that's a few potions we could buy. It's not bad. It is uh, locked. I am scared. Yoshimo is willing. Okay. Let's go ahead and do a little bit of healing. Direct me as you will. All right, absolutely nothing going on here. Yoshimo. You're right behind me, right? Find me some traps, please, or something. I'll take that one gold. History of the Valley of the Gods. History of Halrua, which I think we have already at Dead 3. Eleven gold. Any traps over here? Yep, I had a feeling that, that there might be a trap there. Ooh, lots of gold. And some potions. Angel skin ring. It is and, done. Whoops. Wrong person. Very well. Hiya. Alright, let's see. I've got fifteen. You have ten. You have ten. You have ten. You have eight. You have four. You shouldn't need them as m shouldn't need as many. Let's give them to Minsk. Really would like to have a potion bag. I'm not sure that there are any in the game. Alright, things that I should probably do something about. Okay, I don't need the red piece of cloth anymore. Uh, protection from undead. Let's give that to someone else. I should really use some of these potions, too. Alright, well, some of these things I can sell, so there is that. Put that away, I give that to you. We'll get rid of that. I'll hold the books for now. Alright, let me get back to uh, by the Copper Coronet, Galen Bale's house deposit some things. Actually, I should sell some things first. Oh, well, we haven't been to the Temple of Helm. Uh, maybe we'll do that first. I haven't been in here. Is there anything up here? You shall never have her, you ridiculous fool. Hi. No. It is you that shall never have her. She loves me. No. She loves me. Me. What did I get myself into? Boys, boys, don't fight over me, please. Is she really named Bubbles? Fight over her? What an excellent idea. Yes, we shall fight over our beloved Bubbles. Yes, that sounds most wonderful. Shall we start now? Certainly, if you wish to. Certainly. Uh, well, fine. Go ahead, then, if that's what you boys have to do. Can can I can I stop you? Cannot initiate dialogue. Shank appears busy. Can, 
Can I talk to... Can I not talk to you? No? No? Alright. Most excellent. I have defeated loathsome Carbos. Come, my beloved Bubbles, let us go. You splattered blood on my dress, you ignorant dolt. I'm not going anywhere with you. Bubbles, but... But Bubbles, but I love you, my chicken pot pie. Come back. Oh, I'll take that. Can I talk to you? What about you? No. Uh, Yoshimu? Yokata, I have made something mine and none other wiser. Uh, I think Bubbles has disappeared, too. Uh, we'll take that one gold. Alright, congratulations, you killed your uh, friend for nothing. You're a terrible, terrible human being. Quickly and precisely. Actually, I don't know that they're friends, but... Whatever. Should try pickpocketing the cats. Might get a hairball out of it. Uh, I thought there was a shopkeeper over here. Oh, does that shopkeeper, like, not there because of Hair Dollis not being here, or what? Oh, well, whatever. I'll take a look at what you have. Did you have anything interesting? Not really. Actually. Just make sure that I don't... Right, that's full now. Um, let's take the wooden stakes out for the moment. Let's see what you have. All right. The mail. All these things. Not going to sell any of those. I can't sell Yoshimo's katana. Aw. That's not fair. I'm going to keep the Mail of the Dead for now. Not sure why those didn't stack, but whatever. Doesn't matter. Halberd plus one. Six two-handed swords. It's a lot. Seven suits of plate armor. Very nice. More two-handed swords. I don't know why they don't always stack in here, but uh, whatever. Uh, two quarter staves plus one, but uh, I'll hold off on not sell on, on selling them. I, I think we're okay holding on to them. I have three composite longbows plus one. I can probably buy them back if I feel like I really need them. Otherwise, I mean, that's 2,200 gold right there, so... How does this guy just have 6,000 gold in his pockets? It's kind of crazy. Anyway, um, yeah, that's, uh... That's quite a bit of money that I have now. I do approve. I have other things that I could sell if I wanted. Let's see, I have... AC7... You have AC8. Aren't, isn't that what those are? AC7? Yeah, they are. Whoops. My mistake. That is going to be better. All right. Uh, when we come back next time, well, I will try to get to uh, Galen Bale's place again, drop off some things, and we'll see if the people... Uh, it's hour 17, so we might be able to see the, uh, um, the ransom drop at night. 
Although we've just take we've taken care of the ransom ears, so who knows? Anyway, that will be next time. See you then, everyone.